Oh, Marco. Hello, hello. hello. Who are you? I'm fine. Very well. Very the well. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hey, hello, teacher. How are you? We can hear you, teacher. Hello. <clears throat> hey, now, can you listen to me now? Yeah. Yes, teacher. Uh, yes, sir. Okay, perfect. Hey, you looking you looking good, and, <laughs> and, and you and your family. Ah, uh, yeah, man, it, it is. It's growing. It's growing. <laughs> I I see. I see. I see you very happy, but the baby, all right. Ah, uh, yeah, I mean, it was really happy. children. How many? Uh, how many students do I got? Okay, right it's nice. Let me see. Hey, Jorge, it, it wasn't, wasn't you the one that told me that you wouldn't continue in this module? But it's, it's, uh, good, to, it's good to see you here again. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, and, and you know what? The one that told that he was con in, in the process, you know, like continuing the process, Eric is no longer going again in the process. Really? Yeah. Uh, and me... Because the other other class in the in the university, but the stop right this moment. Uh, ah. I take in the maybe next year. I, ah, I okay, hey, that's why one that's change right. for the, the the practice the English. All right, <laughs> in the cometer muchos errores. That's good. That's good. <laughs> So good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Juan Carlos, and I am going to be your teacher uh, for this module number five. It's really good to have you here. Uh, I just got, let me see, two people from my previous module, the one I was teaching. I think it's Jennifer, if I'm not wrong. Jennifer, is that you, Jennifer? Or do I have another Jennifer in here? <laughs> Hello, teacher. I am. Oh. So then it's you. <laughs> yeah. So then it's 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 teacher. you. Okay. <laughs> teacher. Hi. Ando ando convaleciente porque me ha quitado una cordal. Ah, really? <laughs> Ooh, sorry sí. to hear that. Yeah, eso es bastante eh, doloroso. Pero bueno, ya va a estar mejor, no se preocupe. All right. Dentro de 30 eh, minutos la perdemos. Thank tí, you. No I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, I mean, me too. Yo no puedo decir lo mismo porque no la veo todavía, ¿verdad? Igual, no la yeah. vemos. Tranquila, no tranquila. No la vemos, ¿verdad? Ya tengo que pedir la copia. Gran rato, ok. ¿Cómo fue, Jorge? En 80 minutos no, no, la no. perdemos. En 30 minutos la perdemos. Ah, ok, all right. Ok, so it was just Jennifer and Jorge, the ones from A my module. Hey, hello, my friend. And Good to see you. Apparently... <laughs> Apparently, you know each other. All right. Cool. Uh, Amilcar is 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 a, is uh, the last model with you, uh, and we meet by partner. Ah, okay. Eleven, eleven, three in the eleven, three. Ah, I mean module number eleven, three. Eleven ah. one and, and eleven four. Eleven. Eleven, uh, and, uh, no, eleven three in eleven, eleven four. Three. Uh, you, were was, not, you were in not eleven ten. four lost. <laughs> ah, okay, cool, cool. So let me see who are the new ones for this module. So I'm gonna have Alfredo, right? Hi, Alfredo. Uh, Marco David, Domingo Alexander. All right, pretty cool. You, Milker. I got, I, I got the feeling that Carlos Gualberto, I had it in one module, but I don't remember where. It was module number one or number two, Carlos. Hi, teacher. Nice to Hi. see you again. Nice to see you again, too. Yeah. I don't remember if it uh, was module number one or module number two. Number one. Number one, right? I am in. Yeah. But it was by by March, right? March from this year? Yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah. Long time ago. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's really good to see you. Really good to see you. So let me see who's... <laughs> 
lose another one. All right, Jose Matias. I mean, Jonathan. Hi, Jonathan. Good to see you again. Uh, let me see who else. Rosa. I mean, hi. I think Rosa is the same. Uh -huh, Rosa, yeah, I mean. Hi, Rosa. Are you there? Hi, teacher. Hi, I mean, it's you. So then it's you. Hi. Good to see you again. Se va levantando, ¿verdad? Huh? Okay. No, que va. Responsible person. You're on time for the module. Cool. <laughs> and, and Maritza. Is it the same Maritza? Let me see. Are you there, Maritza? Or do, do I have another Maritza in here? Let me see. Probably she's not there. All right. Let, let's, let's, let's expect she, she, she's going to join us. Right? So people, as I told you, uh, my name is Juan Carlos and I'm going to be your teacher for this module number five. Basically, this is going to be the last module from this year, right? The last module that we are going to be, uh, you know, like uh, starting this year and next year, uh, we are going to basically finish the basic, right? The six modules <laughs> that compounds the basic. Really? Yes. Really? Yeah, no. there are six modules. <laughs> So this is like the number five, one more module, and you are going to jump into intermediate level. That's pretty cool. That's really, really nice, right? Okay. Uh, as you know, as a general uh, like um, information, I got to show you the, the, a short presentation uh, with uh, the requirements that INSA Forb, and in this case also Inglés Corporativo has for you people. Uh, you know, just just for you to 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 remember uh, the rules, okay, that we got to have uh, throughout this module. So just give me a second. I'm going to share the presentation just with the requirements. Just let let me check where do I have it. Ah, okay. Can you see my presentation, people? Can you confirm if you can see my presentation? Yes. 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 All right, perfect. Okay. Uh, as you know, like the name of the course is this is the English for Work program. Uh, this is the basic module number five. And that's my complete name as your instructor, right? So as I told you, my, my name is like Juan Carlos Hernandez Mahano. Uh, and in here, you can see a brief information about my, you know, like my resume, the things that I have been doing, my job experience and everything, right? This is un poco, uh, I'm gonna say this in Spanish, un poco de, 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 de información de su facilitador, o sea, mi persona, uh, para que poco a poco nos vayamos conociendo, ya luego ustedes se van a presentar también, porque quiero conocerlos, quiero saber con quién con quienes voy a estar uh, en este módulo. Ya algunos pues los conozco del módulo pasado, otros que vienen desde el módulo 1 uh, conmigo. Y pues poco a poco vamos a ir reconociéndonos, right? Porque sí, ahora veo que en este módulo sí tengo bastantes, bastantes nuevos. Y eso es bastante interesante. That's really interesting. All right. So... Vamos a comenzar un poco con los requerimientos que siempre, eh, como ustedes saben, piden SAFOR. Y pues eh, igual es bueno conocerlos eh, desde el principio del módulo para que así no haya ningún tipo de duda. Eh, si es que todavía no, no, no hemos recordado este, este aspecto. Va, entre los requerimientos están que al conectarse ustedes tienen que colocar su nombre completo. Ok. En el caso de oyentes, eh, agregar la palabra oyente entre paréntesis luego de su nombre. Esto siempre se va a hacer cada vez que nos conectemos a, a la clase, ¿ok? En, en Zoom. ¿Por qué es esto? Pues porque así de, eh, de, de, de esta manera, cuando Insafor audita este tipo de, 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 de clases, recordemos que básicamente... Uh, todo está siendo uh, grabado. Entonces, ya cuando lo auditan, pues así pueden ellos saber. Uh, give me a second. Oh, 
masculino. Así pueden saber eh, que ustedes son la, 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 la persona que está suscrita, al, al, a, está escrita en este caso al módulo, ¿ok? Ya que, pues, si no colocamos el nombre completo, a, a veces suelen aparecer los nombres de sus, de sus celulares, ¿right? Como Samsung Galaxy eh, J1, a veces. El, bueno, los modelos ustedes ya saben, ¿right? Bien. Otro aspecto es la cámara encendida durante toda la sesión. Esto igual es un requerimiento que, que siempre he solicitado por Insafor. Y luego tenemos otro aspecto que es minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible. ¿Por qué? Porque a veces, bueno, y esto siempre lo digo, a veces suceden casos en los que se les olvida eh, cerrar el micrófono y pues a veces eh, escuchamos conversaciones que, que pues sí, ¿verdad? No, no. No, no, no son muy, muy, muy cómodas, por así decirlo. O a veces, no sé. Es un tanto incómodo, por así decirlo. Así lo vamos a dejar. Entonces, a veces se ponen a regañar al niño, a la esposa, ¿verdad? O, o la esposa al esposo. Y así que para no escucharlo así, ¿verdad? Y que los demás vayan a reírse. Vamos a tener en cuenta eso. ¿Ok? Ah, luego eh, tenemos la participación activa. Sé que y ustedes sí son bastante participativos eh, durante el, eh, las clases y pues espero que siempre, siempre eh, mantengamos esa dinámica, ¿ok? Bien, vamos a continuar. Ok, acá tenemos igual algunas reglas en cuanto a la asistencia. Ah, para esto, Amilcar, ayúdeme a leer, por favor. Desde el principio. Ok. Asistencia al 100% de las clases. Nah. La asistencia no solamente se toma al estar presente, sino también a cumplir con la clase completa. La asistencia se toma en tres ocasiones. 8 en punto, 9 en punto y 9.55 pm. Se tomará como válida al escuchar al participante decir presente o presente y tener cámara encendida. Perfecto. Sesiones uno a uno disponibles. Cada participante será asignado 10 minutos al finalizar cada clase para aclarar dudas con su facilitador. Permisos no disponibles. Yes. En este caso, pues, uh, como ustedes saben, la asistencia sí va lo más que se pueda y, y lo... lo... Lo ideal es que fuese el 100% de las clases, ¿verdad? Las, asistir a las 20 clases, pero a veces por algo motivos, a veces por problemas de internet no se pueden hacer. Uh, pero igual, lo ideal es el 100% y como mínimo por lo menos un 80%. Eh, igual, la asistencia, recuerden, siempre se toma en tres ocasiones, 8 en punto, 9 y 9.55%. Bien, entonces, eh, esta vez lo he tomado bien, primero explicar esto y luego vamos a pasar a asistencia para iniciar con la clase. Ah, igual, se tomará como válido el escuchar al participante decir presente, que es en español, o en este caso, ok, eh, tiene que ser present en English. Ahí siempre se me, se me fue la E ahí. Entonces, igual, pero lo ideal es present, right Recordemos que ya estamos en un módulo más avanzado, por lo tanto ya va a ser un poco más inglés que español durante el desarrollo de las clases. Y pues igual espero que eh, siempre la participación activa eh, esté de parte de ustedes. Igual las sesiones de uno a uno disponibles eh, va a ser de acuerdo a la lista de asistencias como siempre. Lo que significa que el primero de la lista igual se me va a quedar ahora 10 minutos para retroalimentar un poco sobre la clase vista y así sucesivamente vamos a estar teniendo esos 10 minutos de retroalimentación uh, de manera individual y al finalizar cada clase. Uh, y pues por decisión propia de Insafor, no nuestra, y los permisos igual no están disponibles. Ok. Ya acá no es eh, de parte nuestra que, que, que tenemos este tipo de requerimientos, sino que ya es por parte de eh, Insafor en sí. Bien, vamos a continuar. Sacana. All right. 
vamos a continuar con esas tareas y evaluaciones, que también es otro aspecto bastante eh, importante. Bien, Alfredo, léame el primer punto, por favor. Hey, teacher. Es necesario obtener el 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones para poder completar el curso satisfactoriamente. Ah, perfecto. Es bien sabido que las tareas eh, siempre van a estar en la plataforma, ¿ok? Con cada videoconferencia que nosotros vayamos teniendo eh, va a ser una tarea que ustedes van a ir eh, teniendo y, y tener que desarrollar en la plataforma, ¿ok? Entonces... Ahí dice que es necesario obtener por lo menos el 80% del promedio de tareas para poder aprobar el curso. Ok, creo que esto sí estamos bastante claros. Luego, como segundo punto tenemos las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma, como bien sabemos, justo después de cada clase. Bueno, eso es lo, prácticamente lo que acabo de decir. Luego dice todas las tareas de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completas antes de cada viernes a la medianoche ya que ese registro es enviado al INSAFOR semanalmente. ¿Okay? Bien, entonces ah, ya sabemos que en este caso, cada finalización de semana, básicamente eh, vamos a tener ya cubierta las cinco tareas. En este caso, no va a ser el viernes, sino más bien va a ser el lunes, ya que mañana es asueto. Entonces mañana no vamos a tener la clase, no vamos a tener la sesión, pues porque es, es asueto. Entonces, básicamente nos movemos un día. Ya no estaríamos terminando la semana el viernes, sino que hasta el lunes. Como siguiente punto, dice, la fecha límite para terminar el, el, el examen eh, de medio curso o el midterm que le conocemos es el lunes 15 de noviembre, antes de la medianoche. Este recordemos que es en la segunda semana. Al finalizar la segunda semana eh, se desarrolla este examen y es para evaluar cómo vamos en el proceso, qué tanto hemos aprendido de cada uno de los temas cubiertos. Luego dice la fecha límite para terminar el examen final o final exam es el lunes 29 de noviembre antes de la medianoche, que es básicamente el día en que estamos terminando ya con la última clase. Y pues básicamente ya el, el final exam sería ya lo último como nota evaluativa que estaríamos eh, cubriendo. Y luego dice el manual puede ser descargado de la plataforma, no se utilizará material de terceros en ninguna sesión. Bien, eso ya es muy bien sabido que básicamente nosotros vamos a tener como guía el manual, ya como guía de trabajo y como apoyo adicional eh, para explicar de cierta manera algunos de los temas eh, pues va a hacer algunas presentaciones en PowerPoint. Bien. Dicho esto, creo que todo está quedando bien, eh, bien claro. ¿O hay alguna pregunta? ¿Hasta acá tienen alguna pregunta o todo está claro? Todo bien. All right. Todo claro. Perfecto. All right. Entonces... Y acá, pues, básicamente algunas de las cosas que ustedes ya saben sobre la plataforma Zoom, ¿verdad? ¿vale? El botón de silencio, mute, eh, tienen la cámara encendida, tienen la parte del chat, con lo cual lo podemos estar comunicando. Uh, just give me a second. Ok. Eh... Igual uh, tenemos los breakout rooms, que son los, las sesiones en las cuales nos vamos a estar uh, dividiendo para trabajar en pequeños grupos, parte de los temas. Y luego tenemos ahí también adherido el botón de Ask for Help. Cuando estamos trabajando en los breakout rooms, si ustedes solicitan algún tipo de ayuda, eh, solo le presionan el botoncito y pues automáticamente puedo uh, llegar ahí para poder uh, solventar cualquier duda que ustedes puedan tener. Bien, hecho esto, let me see, I think this is, this is everything. Bien, al menos en ese aspecto, con lineamientos generales, eso es todo. Ahora bien, vamos a pasar a, ahora sí, la lista de asistencia, para luego iniciar con el primer tema que tenemos este día. Pero antes de ello, uh, como les había mencionado, uh, vamos a irnos conociendo poco a poco. Así que... Permítame, primero vamos a comenzar con...
la lista de asistencia. A ver, Alfredo Alexander. Present. All right. Thank you. Amilcar Cañengues. Present, teacher. Oh, okay. Good. Carlos Gualberto. Carlos Gualberto. Is it there? Ok. Creo que se desconectó. gusto se desconectó. Hace rato estaba ahí. All right. Probably he's going to join us. Domingo Alexander. Good evening. Present. Good. Thank you, uh, Domingo. Good evening, Hilmar. Late as always, right? <laughs> okay, good. That's all. For it. <laughs> yeah. Ever de Jesús. Present teacher. Okay, great. Fatima Alejandra. Fatima, Fatima. No, nah, he's not here. She's not here. Uh, Hilmar Cruz. Present. Just on time, Hilmar. Just on time. Yes. Yeah. Jonathan Alexander. Present. Okay, perfect. Jorge Elvir. Present. Okay. Jose Matias. Present. Okay, very good. Carla Benacer. Hi, teacher. Present. Hi. All right. Good to see you again. Let's see. Marco David. Present, teacher. Okay, very good. Maritza Alcira. Present, teacher. Okay, great. Marlon Alberto. All right, Marlon is not here. here. Mauricio Alexander. Uh, present teacher. Okay, good. Hey, we got the same last name. Ooh, I'm Mahano too. Na, 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 na. Romeo Alexis. Ah, Romeo is not here. Rosa del Carmen. Present. Now, okay, very good. Vanessa Odette. No, she's not here. Mm. William Eduardo. Okay. Present. Ah, it's here. Okay, thank you, William. Jasmine Melanie. Mm -hmm. It's not here. Okay. Natalie Vanessa. I mean, Natalie's not here. Stephanie Lisette. Okay. It is not here. And William Alberto. I think William is the one that told me that he was not coming to the class this today. Just give me a second. Jennifer, uh, are you going to Present. be as, are you going to be as a listener, Jennifer? Perdón, teacher. Give me a second. Estará como oyente, Jennifer, o de tienes. Preferiría que no. Okay, let me see. Jorge Jonathan, es que no me aparece en la lista. Bueno, pero. Al principio, creo que la mencionó, Tich. Let me see. Mm, Alfredo, Milker, no, Fátima, Gilmar. No. 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 Marco Marinza. No. Es que yo ya había enviado mi documentación, pero hasta ahora, yo, a mí me pareció raro que no me habían mandado convocatoria. Y me dijeron, ahora me mandaron el link, pero revisé la plataforma y no estoy, no, no tengo todavía el módulo 5. Ah, ok, all right. Okay. Ah, me voy a poner en contacto, no se preocupe, y luego vamos a ver cómo solucionamos eso, ok? No problem. All right. 
Okay, yeah. cool. Before starting with the class, people, before starting with the first uh, topic that we're going to be discussing today, uh, first of all, as I told you, we are in uh, one step up, module five. So from now on, we are going to avoid Spanish and speak more English, right? So if you do not understand, listen, if you do not understand some things that probably I am explaining, just please let me know. Teacher, I don't understand. Please uh, explain again, okay? And I will uh, do it again. One uh, more uh, uh, point is that if I am explaining something in the class and you people don't understand what I'm saying, just turn on the, you know, like the microphone and tell me, teacher, I don't understand that topic. Can you please explain again? And I will do it, okay? So in that way, I want that 100% the, the topic I am explaining, you understand everything, okay? Good. The first thing that we're going to start is like, I want to know you people. I want to really know you, uh, where you are from and uh, your name. That's what I'm going to start with, all right? And then of course, we're going to start with the topic that we got for today. Uh, the first thing I'm going to start with Alfredo. Alfredo, where are you from, Alfredo? Just tell us where are you from for your, uh, you know, like classmates to, to know you because I guess you have new classmates, right? You have new classmates this module? This module, yes. All right, cool. And new. <laughs> ah, okay, cool. So can you I'm tell me? I'm from El Salvador. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Uh, are you from San Salvador? Uh, well, uh, I mean? live in Aguilares, no, in San Salvador ah. City. All right, very good. And I work in a sugar mill. Ingenio Sucarero. Ah, okay, very good. Uh, and the sugar mill, I'm a supervisor. Ah, you're a supervisor over there. Okay, very interesting. So welcome, Alfredo, right? So now, I, Marco. Same, Marco. Tell us a little yeah. bit about what do you do and, 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 you know, like, present yourself to the world. All right, good evening, everybody. My name is Marco David Velázquez, and I work in a manufacturing uh, club, on okay. shirt, Nike, and on Under Armour. And I am mechanic, and we uh, and I learn with us. Okay, very good. Thank you, Marco. All right, uh, Domingo, nice your turn. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. Uh, my name is Domingo Alexander Gonzalez. Uh, I work in uh, Industrias uh, Rayones. Okay. Uh, I, 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 I live in I live, I live. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, my working is, is uh, technical electrical. Okay, very good. Very interesting. Right, so welcome, Domingo. It's good to have you here, right? Maritza, it's now your turn. Good evening, everybody. My name is Maritza Castellón. Um, I work in at, at Prodmi. I am executive secretary. Okay, very um, good. As, um, I am manager assistant. Okay, very good. You're a manager um, assistant. There you go. Very good. Thank you, Maritza. Okay, Ever. Okay, good night, everyone. Good night, teacher. Hi. Nice to meet you, everyone. And um, we have a importer, and I am in a chair of the sales of the company. And I am from to the Bronx in the San Salvadorian. So yeah, Bronx. <laughs> okay, all right. Very good, Evan. Nice. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Rosa. 
Now it's your turn, Rosa. Are you there, Rosa? I think Rosa fell asleep. <laughs> Ah, no, yeah, she's there. Ah. Ay, qué barbaridad. Cuando no contesto, se dice, va. Yeah, I, I can imagine that you fall asleep because you're in, you're, you're in your bed. I mean, if you're like, like lying on the bed, probably you got to sleep. <laughs> okay, Rosa. Present to everybody. Okay. And so what do you do? Uh, my name is Rosa Enriquez. I am cashier and I'm from... Alta Vista. Alta Vista. Ah, okay. Okay. Alta Vista. That's from San Salvador, right? It's because yes. I, uh, San Salvador. All right. I don't know that much San Salvador. That's why I'm asking. Yeah. Okay, Rosa. Good. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to say where I am from because uh, when I say that, uh, uh, my students are bullying me. So that's why I, I don't say anything. I, I prefer to be quiet on that. Thank you, Rosa. All right, Jonathan, your turn. Hello, teacher. Hello, guys. Uh, my name is Jonathan Alexander. <clears throat> um, I live in San Salvador. My worry is Scissor, um, Scissor, Scissor, Technical. All right. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean. Okay, just that. All right. Thank you, Jonathan. Hilmar, now's your turn. Okay. Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is. Gilmar Mendez. I live in Santa Tecla. I work in San Salvador, uh, working in computer system. All right. He's a computer specialist. Okay, very good, Gilmar. Nice. Okay, thank you. Carla, that's your turn. <clears throat> good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Carla Lara. Um, I'm, I live in the San Salvador. Um, I am. I work in a recycling company. I am export assistant. Okay, very good. An exportation assistant. Okay, there you go. Yes. Thank you, Carla. Jennifer. Your turn, Jennifer. Hello. Good evening. Mm -hmm. My name is Jennifer Mata. I am a science teacher. And I live in Cofetepeque. Okay. And I work in here. Now, okay, very good. There you go. Thank you, Jennifer. Now it's Jose Matias' turn. Good evening, people. Good evening. Uh, my name is uh, Matias Ramirez. And uh, my iPhone. I from live in Apopa City. Okay. Yes, I am working in in printing and of cut, cutting paper. And only that. All right. Okay. Very good, uh, Jose. Thank you. All right, Jorge. Your turn, Hello. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Uh, first, is, it's good to see you again, and uh, uh, our people, okay. uh, and, the, and the new people. Uh, uh, it's a pleasure. Uh, my name is Jorge Elvir Miranda. Uh, I live in Santa Tecla City. I'm working in the administrative system in the custom <laughs> del Salvador. Okay, very good. It's all. That's all? All right. It's all. For okay. the moment. <laughs> Just for the moment. Okay. Very yeah. Good. Okay, hi. Very good. Carlos Gualberto. Good evening. 
everyone. My name is Carlos Gualberto Rodriguez. Uh, I live in Santa Ana. My work is, um, I am a mechanic in a manufacturing company. Okay, very good. Okay, mechanic. Very good. All right, Carlos. Welcome back. It's really good to see you again, right? Yeah, I mean, solo usted lo veo de, 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 esa, de ese mega grupo que había antes. <laughs> solo yo he quedado. Los sobrevivientes. <laughs> All right, that's cool. That's really cool. Sí. All right. Amil Carcañegues. Good evening, everybody. My name is Amil Carcañegues. I live in Santa Tecla. And I'm working as assistant, account assistant. Okay, your account assistant. Okay, there you go. Uh, let me see who's missing. Thank you, by the way, Amel Carter. Uh, let me see who's missing. Yeah, Carla has already participated. Uh, let's see, Eve, Rosa, Maritza. Uh, Mauricio. Yeah, Mauricio is missing. Uh, my name is Mauricio Alexander Mahano. I live in Ilopango City. Uh, I work in, in Mejia Hernandez Isia. I am the general account. Okay, very good. There you go, Mauricio. It's good to have you here. All right. Uh, and let me see another one, William. Good evening, classmate. I live in San Juan of Pico City. I work in Galvanizadora Industrial. I am operate machine industry. Okay, very good. Thank you, William. It's good to have you here. Uh, let's see, and the last one, the last one. I don't know if this, this is this is the one that told me. Um, uh, Jose, are you? Are you yet in, in uh, busy in there where you are? Can you can you talk? I think he's just a listener, right? Me? Yes. Matia. Yeah, right. Okay. Mm, no, no mucho. I am, and you told me right that you are you're kind of uh, in there in the okay. morning. Okay, no problem. Okay. Okay, mister. All right, so uh, we have uh, already completed the group in there. There are missing a lot of people. Probably uh, on uh, Wednesday, we got a full, full, full version of everybody here. So we're going to start with uh, the first topic of this module. Just give me a second, I'm going to put in here. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me see. I'm going to make this bigger. Okay. So, can you see my presentation, people? Can you confirm that you can see my presentation? Yes. All right. Very good. So, this is the video conference number one. Uh, and today's topic, right, for the rest of the class. It's going to be words to mark steps in a process, okay? This is going to be the first uh, topic that we're gonna have. What does it mean? It means that we are going to be practicing a series of words that can mark uh, steps in a process. It can be any process. It can be uh, processes in cooking, processes in manufacturing, processes in everything. There are just basic words, some of them, you know them already, but in this case, we're gonna practice them as that, as the one that marks steps in a process. So as part of a class agenda that we have for tonight, uh, we did the welcome into the module, something that we finished already, rules for this module, something that we did in the presentation before. Okay, and now we're going to start with works to march the steps in the process. That as I told you, there are some words that are really, really basic, but are really important when we are uh, talking 
or when we talk about certain processes that we do. Let's remember that every activity that we do requires a process. So basically these words, what they do is just to mark the steps what goes first, what goes second, what goes third, and what goes at the end. So that's what we are going to be practicing tonight. And at the end, we're going to end up with a conversation practice, right? And then we are going to be working, you know, like in some breakout rooms related to, to the topic, of course. So let's start with this. All right, words to discuss or words to basically represents uh, represents steps for a process. These are the ones that we are going to be practicing, okay? These are the ones that we are going to be practicing. What are we going to do with these words? We are going to see them how to act as in a process. Then we're going to put them in a conversation and finally we're going to you know, do a series of activities, okay, uh, oral activities with this with these words. We got uh, the words as first, second, we got third, we got then, later, after, right after, then we got next, and we got finally. So these are the words that we are going to be basically uh, talking about, right? Throughout uh, this, this, this part of the class, right? As I told you, these words are the ones that mark a series of steps when we mention a process. Let's remember that every activity that we do, everything requires a series of steps or processes. Like for example, when we wake up in a new day, what is the first thing that we do? All right, the first thing is like wake up, then is a stand up, then probably is going to the bathroom, okay? So that series of steps, it's basically a process, right? And these words help us to describe those processes, okay? In here, with this, with these words, do we know them all or do we have any of these words that we don't understand them? Or do we understand everything in here? All the words that are in here. Do we understand them all? Yes, teacher. Okay. I guess uh, we understand them all. This is even better for us, right? Let's remember first. It's like primero, right? When we start talking about a process, then second, the steps that follows, then third, then then, right? What is then? Después. All right. It's like luego, right? Después. Later, like después o más tarde, okay? After that or after, okay? Después de right after, justo después de, right? It's like when we finish one activity or one step on a process and we follow into another process, right? Then we got next and finally. Que básicamente esa, esa, esa palabra, like finally, is like when we talk about the ending of a process, right? Let's put them into context. Let's put these words into context, right? As an example, first, Alfredo, help me out reading. This is just just in a step how to how to do something, how to prepare something. Yes. Combine mar margarine, margarine sugar, margarine sugar to add and vanilla. Vanilla. All right, very good. All right, first, thank you, Alfredo. All right, first, combine margarine and sugar, two eggs, and vanilla. Let's identify. What process are we talking about in this series of examples? Okay, then second, Amilka. So finally, combine flour, baking powder, and salt. All right, second, it says separately combine flour. Do you know what is flour? Harina. Harina. Very good. 
and baking powder. Polvo de hornear. Ah, okay, right? Uh, that, okay, okay, yeah, baking powder or polvo de hornear, right? In there, and then salt. Oh. You go. Let's see what is this formula or series of steps about. Ever, help me already with number three. <laughs> okay, syrup combine both mixtures with milk. Okay, very good. Let's identify what are we talking about in this process. Thank you, Ever. Okay, let's read the next one. Marco. Number four, later. <clears throat> chill for one hour. Okay, later, chill for one hour, right? Like, let everything just for one hour, okay? Very good. And number five, Domingo. After call the mister uh, to about a quart in time. I'm time to. Okay, quart inch thick. Quart inch thick, uh, thick in this case. You know what is inch? Inch thick. Pulgada. Exactly, Pulgada. right? Pulgada, right? Inch thick. And you know what is thick? Thick significa grosor, right? A, a quarter inch thick, right? Un cuarto de pulgada de, de, de grueso, right? De grosor, in this case. There you go. Very good. Next, it says, uh, this is going to be like kind of uh, short. Carlos? Next. Cut cookies. Cut cookies. Cut cookies. Okay, cut. Yeah, like the, the pronunciation of this bird is like, like the animal, cut, okay? Cut. There you go, very good. Okay. Number seven, like the final product, Hilmar. Like for 10 minutes. Okay, I almost didn't understand what you said because you were like too far away from the microphone, but good, Hilmar, right? Very good. Now, Jennifer. Can you tell me what is this preparation for? What is this process about? Because we have a series of steps, right? What are we preparing in this case, Jennifer? What are the steps talking about in this case? What are we preparing with these steps? A cake. A cake? Ah, mm. right. interesting. Mm. Are you sure it might be a cake? Pareciera. <laughs> Pareciera. De marquesote. Marquesote. Is it a marquesote, was it? Yes, a marquesote. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Okay. Let's see. We got a writers, right? Jennifer says that, that probably is a cake, right? Jose says that it's a marquesote. Exactly. Salporazón. <laughs> Salpora. <laughs> okay. All right. What do you think, uh, Mauricio? What do you think it is? What is this process about? Uh, pancake. Pancake? Yes. Pancake. Ah, pretty interesting. Yes. Did you agree, Amilcar? Okay. So Who else agree, agree to Mauricio and, and Amilcar? What do you say, Jorge? It's the same. It the same. It's correct. Uh, well, pancake. Yes, it's correct, Amilcar. No. It's pancake. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Pretty interesting. Um, pa pie. Pie. Como dice America Pie? American <laughs> Pie. American <laughs> Pie. Un pie. Hey, no me molejos ahí con American Pie. Okay. No, porque no, eh, para hacer pancake no lleva polvo de hornear. Y ahí dice polvo de hornear. Es no, como leva, es, es, you know what is that, right? Pues, básicamente se refiere a levadura. A levadura. Ajá. Es, 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 power. Ajá. Eh, es que la es mezcla que, que, la mezcla del es que tiene una pol... eso. 
Real. Porque tiene una pulgada la, me, la mezcla de, de pan. Ajá, y la mezcla Esas de pan que no lleva azúcar. Es no, ah, vale, instinto. Ay, sí, Teacher, okay. maybe brownie, vaya. Brownies. <risa> ok. Brownie. Ahí faltamos los ingredientes. Pero make, you, make you feel happier. Yeah, the the okay, right. change for the baking power. Okay. All right, pretty mm, interesting. Here for one hour. But the pancake will take one hour. Ah, cabal. Here for one hour. Let me one see. Hour. No, puede, no, eso puede one ser. hour. It means that you mix. No, es que you mix the ingredients and let them there. Lo tiene que lo que tiene que mo lo tiene que estar meneando por una hora. Ese solo es en la masa para hacer pan dulce. O pan francés. Que quitos, vaya. All right, all right, all right. Nah, Puede ser pan case, francés. Case, no, no, pan francés case. no lleva vainilla. La vainilla solo la lleva el marquesote. <laughs> the vanilla is just for, for the marquesote. All right, now nah, it says, it, it, okay, basically they are, they, what they are doing is in that process is just making cookies, right? Who gives more? Who gives more? <laughs> yeah, this, this is just a preparation to making cookies, right? Just animal cookies. cookies. Yeah, I mean, to make cookies, right? Any, nothing about brownies, cookies. nothing about, you know, like. <laughs> All right. But it would be interesting to know the process, how to make uh, marquesotes, as Jose said. <laughs> Probably we know yeah. that, right? We know that process. Yeah, exactly. Okay. <laughs> All right, that would be kind of interesting the way how, how to prepare that one, right? How to prepare that. Okay, what are we going to do now? Listen, as I told you, this is a series of processes, how to manufacture something, right? As I told you, in everything, we need a process. In every type of activity that we do, we need a process. This is just a process how to make cookies. But as I told you, in our work, we need to have a series of steps, right? As a process, what do we do first? What we do second? What we do third? What we do later? What we do at the end as a final result, right? Everything is a process, right? Everything requires a process. What are we going to do right now? Listen, uh, uh, we are 16. Hmm. Yeah, 16, we are very good, a very good uh, number. Listen, we are going to be divided in uh, groups, uh, in pairs. We're gonna work in pairs. Listen, I do really want you to create a series of steps about something, but without putting a name as this. First, mark the lines of for something, right, as a process. It can be about a recipe related to food. It can be about a process when you work in there, but I want you to prepare something, a series of steps, but don't say at the beginning, don't say what kind of process you are doing. When we come back in here, okay? When we come back in here, you will read your process and your classmates will identify what process or what is the process name for what you did, okay? That's what we are going to be doing in pairs, right? Let's prepare a series of steps about something, what goes first, what goes second, what goes later, and finally, but without putting the name. Don't put the name of your process, okay? Your classmates will try to identify your process name, okay? That's what we are going to be doing in the breakout room right now. I don't know if if any of you have any question about the, the, the activity that we're going to be doing right now. Any question? No, teacher. For the moment, no, teacher. All right, perfect. Perfect. So I'm going to stop a little bit in here and we are going to be working in the breakout rooms. Just give me a second. You are 16. Eight. So we're going to create eight groups. There you go. So let's work in uh, in pairs. Okay. I will give you for this activity. Let me see. Ten minutes. You will have only ten minutes to mark a series of steps as a process, but without putting. Remember, don't put the name of your process. Your classmates will identify the process that you are doing. Okay. Good. 
Let's go for it. Give me a second. Who left the class? Alguien se salió de la clase. Okay. Okay, démosle aceptar. Sí, sí. Yeah. Let's put it. Let's go to work. Let's go to work, everybody. All right, let's enter Maritza. Carlos Jose. Maritza, all right. So Jennifer, I'm going to move the teacher. teacher. Yes. Eh, yo no puedo participar porque no estoy en mi casa. Ah, eh, sí, me que le dije. Ah, sí, perfecto. Sí, entonces, sí, sí, entonces yo, pero yo desde el miércoles yo nunca he faltado a una clase así. Mm -hmm. Pero ahorita, bueno, como le expliqué. Sí, es un caso especial, lo comprendo. No bien, sé. Bien, 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 bien difícil. Ah, no sé, no se preocupe. Bien. Entonces, eh, esperemos acá o solo entre ahí el, al, a la sección. Solo para estar viendo, nada más, ¿ok? Sí, no, sí, no pero es que hay momentitos que me tengo que levantar. Entonces, puede sí. que a las nueve no le diga present, porque tengo que ir moverme un ratito. Okay. Pero, right. pero, o sea, al ratito llego, o sea, ahí, okay. ahí me pone ahí que sí okay. estoy. All right. Ok, no problem. <risa> Muchas All right. gracias. Ok, no problem. Okay. All right. Adiós, si usted me habían dejado solita. Ay, teacher. Me quedo yo, yo hola. <laughs> Hello, everybody. How are you, teacher? Good, perfect. And you? Una, una receta, ¿verdad? Eh, puede ser de cualquier, de cualquier proceso. Cualquier proceso puede ser sobre una receta, puede ser sobre algo relacionado a un trabajo en específico. La idea es que escriban una serie de procesos, ¿ok? Tal y como en el ejemplo. Uh, sin colocar cuál es el proceso en sí eh, que ustedes están haciendo, la serie de pasos. All right? ¿Por qué? Porque sus, clas uh, sus, sus compañeros van a identificar, a tratar de identificar uh, what you're talking about. Okay. okay. Yeah, that's what you're going to be doing, all right? Okay, cool. Pero podemos hacer de comida, ¿verdad? Uh, yeah, I mean, you can, you can put it about food. No problem. Okay. Yeah, all right. Eh, eh, teacher, una consulta. Ajá, ¿sí? Con las actividades que hacemos, desempeñamos en el trabajo, ¿verdad? Puede ser, puede ser sobre eh, el proceso de cómo elaborar algo de una receta. All right, it's up to you. It's up to you. Ah, okay. Yes. La idea es que no me voy a colocar el nombre del proceso porque sus compañeros tienen que tratar de identificarlo. All right? Okay. Hi, teacher. Hi. Hi, Maritza. Think about something Hi. that might that might be kind of like, like you know, like interesting and easy for you. And do it. Mm. Ah. Like for example, the recipe of uh, how to what? How to cook a scramble eggs. Ah, como hacer huevos revueltos, por ejemplo, right? That would be like a recipe. What do you do first? What it goes second? What goes as a third? What goes later? What goes at the end? About something okay. easy. Ah, pues denos más tiempo, teacher, porque yo lo entendí que era enfocado al trabajo. No, pero si lo quieren hacer enfocado al trabajo, no problem. Por eso le, le, le mencionaba, si lo quieren hacer sobre el trabajo, o uh, si lo quieren hacer sobre algo de una receta, no problem. You can do it. Okay. Okay, ah, do pero it. si lo hago en base a mi trabajo, no van a poder detectar qué es, porque detallo qué es lo que hago. Eh. Ajá, ajá. No, lo que pueden hacer es los dos pónganse de acuerdo en qué, en qué hacer, right? Y, y and do it together. 
Okay. Okay. Anyway. Okay. Perfect. Eh, podemos hacer como hacer una pizza. Yeah, you can do that. Yo no sé hacer pizza. <laughs> Ahí eh, Mauricio. ¿Ah? Día, eh, miel, miel, miel is... La ponen a coser, dice. Sí. Eh... Yeah, sería the, the honey that is obtained, obtained is cooked. Ajá, de honey y coque. Sí. sí, ¿verdad? Es coque. Ah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Es scoop. Así terminaría la oración con es scoop. Bueno. Well, everything, okay. Well, everything okay here? ¿Todo bien? Mm, yes. uh, una, ¿Cómo se dice cuando está en su punto adecuado? Sería when. When it is ready. When it is, is ready. Yes, you can even say that. Uh -huh. puesto, when it is, is ready, proper point, it is good. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Also, if you're talking about something that is is being cooked, yeah, you can you can put that way. Mm -hmm. Okay. Second. Dijo dijo ocho pasos para la teacher. Ah, puede ser sobre los puede ser tal y como lo, lo teníamos en el ejemplo, right? With seven, it might be okay. No problem. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Second. En el second. Uh, yeah, 30 minutes. 30 minutes. Thirsty. Okay. Next, cut around of two minutes. What, what, uh, what minute? And to serve on it, the next, the last one, to serve on it. Uh, no, 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 come on, come on. What what the time? What the time cook? Uh, I put it next cut around through all the oven. The oven, yeah. For for uh, twenty Turn. minutes. Twenty minutes. Twenty minutes. Yeah. Huh? Twenty minutes. Twenty minutes. Yeah. Hey teacher, hello. Hi. Hello teacher. <laughs> You are the ghost. Yeah, the ghost. You, you are, you are, you hey, are, man. Uh, hey, did, aparece? Did you ah uh, that appear? Appear? <laughs> I am in it. Appear. It's the short color. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you know, you know something. <laughs> so good. Uh, do you remember the last time that Tell we were me. talking about the crypto coins and everything? Yes. Remember. I, I feel very happy. I, I, I decided to, 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 you know, like to, to invest certain yes. amount of money in one specific coin. You know yes, what? Sir. Last yes. month. That was last month. Yes. And you know what? That coin went to the moon and like, like, and it was like, wow. I earned so nice. like, like, like almost four times the, the, you remember? the, the amount of money that I invested. Yes, is the, the projection for the investment for November and December. Ooh. Yeah, man. I told you, I told you, I told you, teacher. Uh, you and me, I need to talk this topic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, it's pretty cool. 
Very good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, invirtió. Yes, I did. Ah, so nice. Oh. You welcome the investment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> man. Yeah, for sure. No, uh, the the projection so so nice for the November and December in the February in so maybe five or six coin and tokens uh al pasar al tope hasta arriba. Going up. We're going up. Yes. Yeah. It's time for the investment. Maybe. Eh, le voy a decir una. Le voy a decir una que posiblemente puede empezar. Eh, se llama Tor. O vale menos de un centavo de dólar. Really? En diciembre. Ahorita de, ahorita de comprar. Sí. En diciembre. Se espera que llegue por lo menos a un dólar. Si vale un dólar. Si usted invierte 70 dólares. Va a tener aproximadamente unos... 8 mil, 7 mil dólares de, de entrada. You know what? Tell I me. invested, I invested, I'm going to tell you something. I, I invested <laughs> with one that is called Shiva. Ah, Shiva. I put, I put, I put four, four, 400. 400? When it cost, when it, when it was in uh, 19. Okay. 1920. And it go, and it went up, right up to... 75 i think is is is, is right now so okay. i did more than a thousand of of you know like I, you're very happy oh my god and i was like what <laughs> and i was like okay all right uh george uh, uh thank you so much <laughs> <laughs> hey i mean marco is like what what are you talking about <laughs> no marco ah, i understand i understand ah, perfect uh, yeah. okay. I only listen, listen, and I don't investment and coin, but I, I, I think that we change the, the, the opinion. The, new, the opportunity is. Yeah. So this, this moment, November, December, is good opportunity for investment. Uh, right. 100 dólares que pongas en una moneda y vas a ver. Por lo menos Shiba va para arriba, Bitcoin, Bitcoin. Ahorita va a estar abajo, bien abajo va a estar, porque la, el, el elevón lo va a tener ahí por, por el 15, 17 de noviembre y se fue a los 80 mil, 90 mil. Es una buena oportunidad ahorita. Yeah, I mean, good opportunity. Yes. Right, yeah. Hey, teacher. <laughs> very happy yeah, for man, you. Man, thank you for telling me, by the way. I mean, if you don't tell me about that, I, I don't start like, you know, like, like reading and everything and like, I decided it's, to do it. It's, 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 it's important to read and important and the, see the news. And YouTubers, uh, no, maybe, no, 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 not, not too much, much. But, uh, but the news and the newspapers, yes, yes is the All good right. see for the news. Okay, that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Hey, he aprendido más. <laughs> <laughs> you see? Yeah, in English, yeah, I've learned a lot, man. Yes, that's interesting. That's really nice. By the way, okay, how, how are you going with the with the with the activity? <laughs> ah, the activity and the and the four four. Yeah, we finished the four stay, and stay we going to the five. Stay okay, five. right. I think with uh, five more minutes, we are done with that. Okay, all right. All right. Thank, Thank you, teacher. You. See you in see you in class. All right. Good. See you soon, teacher. <laughs> Finally, eat it. Eat. Eating it. Are you sure it wouldn't be dangerous for my health? ¿Y será que si lo como no me va a hacer daño? Wow. <laughs> 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 Vanessa lo pensó. Hmm, hmm. <laughs> All right. I guess I guess you finished already, right? Yes, teacher finished. Okay. Cool. That's pretty interesting. All right. Uh, we're just going to wait for a couple of uh, of minutes because some of your classmates has not finished already. So we're gonna wait for them. 
In the meantime, you can be practicing what you're going to say, all right, as, as a part, you know, uh, in the main section. And I'm going to check other groups, okay? If you finish, good for you people. Okay. All right. Okay. To taste. ¿Cuánto tiempo lo vamos a cocinar? 15 a 20 minutos. Minutes. Finally. Finally. Hornear. Hornear por 15 minutos. Bake sería, ¿verdad? Finally. Bake for 15 minutes. Hey, algo así la tenemos, Pixel. All right, but don't, uh, when you read, when you start reading, don't say, hey, how to make carepas, because I mean, you're giving, right? The, the, the thing. Just mention, right, the, the, the steps. You can. Well, I'm get yeah, all right. Okay, after that. You put the well on the sky. sky. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. Creo que la frase clave va a ser esta. Well, until you have a well, all right? Uh, another thing, another thing, listen, listen. If your classmates don't understand what you're saying, you can say that that food is typically made in Colombia. Ah, uh, yes, um, yes, yes. Yeah, yes. I mean, if they don't understand what you're saying, you can mention that, right? That that yeah. is the typical food from Colombia. And they yeah. will identify the food. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they, 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 will, they will do it. Uh, otra, otra, digamos, other uh, words, uh, bueno, otra palabra clave, ¿no? Uh -huh. Una pequeña pista, ¿verdad? Yeah, but that's, 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 that's a small, you know, like, like yeah. Next, see you have some salt on the dog. All right. Okay. <laughs> then you have flour until the dog gets dried. All right. There's water. Okay, good. I'm going to check just one more group, and then we're going to go back to the main section, okay? Okay, there you go. Let me see it in this. Have you finished already, people? Yes, I'm ready. Uh, right. Very good. So if everybody is ready, so let's go. Let's go to the main section. Let me see. Jonathan Jorge has already finished. Yeah, everybody finished. Okay. Go back to the main section then, all right? See you there. Ha, ah, no, everybody wants to come and <laughs> to the main section. They haven't finished maybe. Nah, but they are coming already. Let's see, let's, let's wait for the rest of your classmates. And uh, um, their teacher. Huh? In, in this, how, are you, how are you, baby teacher? I mean, it's, it's good. I, I took him today to, to the doctor just to check his stomach because uh, there have been some issues with his stomach, but everything is like, like, like perfect now. Yeah, I mean, he, he eats a lot, for real. You know what? I, I got a, a, a can of uh, milk that is like uh, bigger than two pounds. It's like kind of big. It's like, let me see, 820 grams. You know what? He finished that can in seven days in seven days and every can costs like 30 36 dollars it's hard he, he, i know what you say 
he eats a lot. I mean, he's just he's just 17 days and he's eating every every day that, that goes on, it's more and more and more. Yeah, I mean, it's like wow. <laughs> yeah, me asusto. <laughs> Sí, no, es, es, cierto, es cierto lo que le dice Carla, le, le dura bastante, porque en yeah. mi caso me duraban tres días, tres días, tres días aproximadamente, sí, Man. sí, sí. Al, yo, no, y después buscar, ¿Qué pasa? Ay, no me aflijan, <risa> eh, no me aflijan cuando vengo a escuchar de botes de leche, no me aflijan. Bueno, es verdad, es verdad, por real. real man. They, they siento siento que ahí dejaré toda mi vida en esos cumbos de leche. <risa> Yo ya lo estoy haciendo, no, créanme. Asustan. Miren, pero... A Milcar, no me hizo caso. Asustan, asustan. De veras que asustan. Yeah. No, Jorge, ahí, ahí te tenés que olvidar de los juegos de video, Jorge, lo siento. Voy a empezar a vender y de Play, las chelas. el Nintendo. <risa> Ey, no está la yeah, chica man, de las man. chelas tampoco. Ah, yeah, la man, Sarita. Cara. Yeah, man, hey, she's no longer teacher, in, in this class. Teacher, Sorry, man. Con ese número, uh -huh. necesitamos, necesitamos ese, <risa> ese, ese proveedor. Ok, all right. Yeah, I mean, I will. I will. All right. Before doing the activity, I'm going to pass the attendance list. Ok, and then okay. we'll start the activity. Ok, there you go. Right. Cool. <risa> Nah, but it, it's true, man. We you teacher. Ready to have a baby. Be ready. Be ready. Okay. Alfredo Alexander. Present teacher. All right. Amil Carcañengues. Present. Okay, good. Carlos Gualberto. Present. All right. Perfect. Domingo Alexander. Present. Okay. Ever de Jesús. Present teacher. Very nice. Fatima Alejandra, it is not here. Hilmar Cruz. Present. Okay. Jonathan Alexander. Present. Okay. Jorge Elber. Present. Okay. Jose Matias. Ah, Jose Matias. Where is he? Where is he? Okay. I think he left. Marco David. Present. All right. Uh, Maritza Alcira. Present, teacher. Okay. Marlon Alberto. Mm -hmm. All right. It's not here. Mauricio Alexander. Present, teacher. Okay. Romeo Alexis is not here. Rosa del Carmen. Teacher, I'm here. Okay. Jose Matias. Good. I am in, you're right there, right? Okay, Rosa del Carmen, Rosa, Rosa. I am in, Rosa is the one that got disconnected. Hmm. Vanessa Odette. Present teacher. Ah, okay. Good to see you, Vanessa. All right. William Eduardo. I am in William left too. Okay. Uh, Jasmine Melanie. No, it's not here, right? Okay, we got Natalie Vanessa. No here. Stephanie Lisette. No here. And William Alberto, which is not here. Okay, let's start with the ones that we got already here, right? Uh, sure. Yes? No me mencionó. Didn't I? Let me check. Yes. No, I got you already there. Ya está. Oh, okay. That's why. <laughs> Por eso no me apareció. All right, Carla. Um, by the way, Carla, I'm going to start with you. And if oh. I'm you were working with Alfredo, right? Okay. Uh, yes. Perfect. Okay. I want you to describe the steps for the things that you got, for the process that you have. And your classmate, at the end of your reading, your classmate have to identify, okay, what is the process that you're talking about, okay? All okay. right. Okay. Pueden, pueden, pueden leer uh, half and half, mitad y mitad, okay? Just to participate okay. with both. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh, sorry. Uh, 
Okay, first the raw material is millet. Uh, second, the use is purificate. purificate. And third, the water is evaporate for the use. For uh, the honey is cooked. Five, uh, brown sugar is add. Okay, Carla, continue. Thank you, Alfredo. Okay, uh, next, uh, with the crystal ground, they are sent to do centrifugal in the area. Uh, there the honey is um, divided, divided from divided. the grind. Uh -huh. the, okay, divided from the grinds. Um, the crystal are sent to the packing in the area of um, vitamin, teacher, como se dice? Vitamin. Vitamin A is added and the, finally the product is sent to warehouse to be distributed. Distributed, okay. Distributed. Interesting. And everybody's like, what? Why are you talking about? Yes. But it works. Yo pensé de muchas cosas. Y todos quedaron así como con, con la cosita de, de, el del meme cargando. Sí, no digo, no digo, no digo. Dicho, easy, 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 vitaflenaco. Vitaflenaco. Hey, teacher. Ajá, Vilcar. <laughs> nothing of or nothing or about the drugs, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Amphetamina. <laughs> okay. Meta, meta, meta. Okay. Meta. Uh -huh, uh -huh. What do you think, people? It is. What's the process that they were talking about? Amphetaminophen. Tylenol. Marihuanol. Marihuanol. Because uh, they even mention honey and all those things. Maybe yeah. candy. Sugar. Maybe sugar. Can candy. Hey, uh, honey, ca yeah. honey candy. Uh, America sugar. The true sugar. Sugar. Oh. Sugar. Sugar. sugar process. Really? Sugar. Really? That's a sugar process? Yes. Okay, yeah, vitamin. Ah, yeah, when, when, <laughs> you, like, when you added. squash, right? When you squash the, the, the you know, like the, the, the cane, the stick, you can get the, the, the honey, right? That's that's a type of honey. The la caña. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> okay. Interesting. All right, there you go. All right. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, Alfredo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> No, I mean, it is like, like marijuana is that's his medicine, man. We were talking yeah, about medicine. Yeah, yeah I mean, yeah. we are too depending on medicine. That's why we're thinking about that. Mientras no se puma. Depend. Yeah, man, exactly. All right, good. Ever. Okay, who in the, uh, I mean, who was the person that you were working with? Okay, I working with uh, I don't know Armando. Armando, where is Armando? Is there? Okay. Okay, the first, the first we need to cut the vegetables. The vegetable? Ah, uh, cut the vegetable. Vegetable. Second, uh, boil water of cooking food. And the third, clean the chicken. Uh, Amica, okay. the next. Okay. And then cook and peel the chicken after combine all ingredients. After I cook around 30 minutes and next serve and eat. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Hey, I'm hungry already. 
Easy, easy. It's very easy. In your preparation. Yo, yo a lo veo más joven sin el bigote. Chicken soup. <laughs> okay. And your preparation is panes con pollo, right? <laughs> no, 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 no. All right. Okay. What do you think it is? Chicken soup. What do you think it is, people? What, what is the What is the process? Chicken soup. China Casi dijo pollo soup. campero, dijo. <laughs> China, 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 China es food. No, Magic no, soup. Chinese no, food. Chicken soup. Chicken, chicken soup. soup. Chicken soup. That's the process. Marihuana. <laughs> <laughs> ok. <laughs> ya caldo con, que... con, con, con pollos, ok. Chicken and bison. Yeah, something very, very, very Maru, Maruchan estaban haciendo esto. <laughs> no, it, it's chicken and bicycle. Chicken? Yes, yes. Chicken soup. Really? Chicken soup? You were talking about chicken, chicken soup? soup? Really? Yes, chicken okay. soup. Uh, All right. Oh, vegeto. And, ah, uh, that's why uh, they were mentioning vegetables, right? Ah, okay. Veg All right. It's chicken soup. All right. Okay. I'm going to tell my wife to, to, to take notes about the recipe so she can do it. Mm. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> All right. Okay, good. Thank you, Ever and Amilcar. You did it excellent. Now, Elmer, your tour, mister. Okay. Is with Jennifer. Okay. Okay. Jennifer. Eh, comienzo. Her. Turn camera, Jennifer. Comienzo. Eh, también estamos con José Matías, pero él creo que no puede participar. Yeah, I mean, he's, 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 uh -huh, he's, he's, he said that he's busy. All right, no problem. Uh, typical Colombian food. Mm. Mm. You should, uh, Hilma, you should have said that at the end. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, anyways, all right, continue, continue, man. How to make? First, still add what it is about those to cook as well. Uh -huh. Then you add the flour until that gets destroyed. Next, you add some salt on the dot. Uh huh. Jennifer, continue. Number number four. After you take a bowl of dog and carefully crush it until have a wheel. Number five. After that, you put the wheel on the skillet. Number six. Finally, you get your delicious food. What do you do? Okay, they were talking about a will, it says. What do you think they are talking about? Tamales. Tamales. <laughs> let's remember, let's remember that they were mentioning that is that, that that's a typical food it's from Colombia. Colombia. Yes. Colombia. Colombia. All right. Okay. <laughs> Coca en vuelta. A los colombianos no les gustaría esto. Como que la gente no la consume. Ok. Ajá, what is it? What's that, what, what's that process that they were talking about? Suena como de esos panes, algo así, pero que son como que, fue, como, que que fuera el, como que fuera el proceso de la flor de isoto. <risa> Con huevo. <risa> son más tan especiales que hasta la flor nacional le damos vuelta. <risa> <risa> ok, all right. What, what do you think, people? It is. What's the most recognized food, uh, typical food from Colombia? I don't know, teacher. Uh, oh. Mm -mm. Arepa. We only ah. listen to Pablo yeah. Escobar. Only, only... <laughs> <laughs> somebody somebody said that already. Arepa? Uh, yes. 
All right. Yeah, I mean, that's the process that they were talking about. Oh. Yeah, I mean, that's why they were mentioning wheels. That was, that was another uh, key. Este <laughs> man no salió parcero. No ha salido barraco. Barraco o berraco? Berraco. No, berraco. <laughs> Por poco dice barranco. barranco. <laughs> Soy barranco, no berraco. Okay. <laughs> All right, very good. Very good people. Okay, good. Uh, let's see. Thank you, Elmer and Jennifer. Uh, what is uh, this? Finally, teacher. Huh? Finally, what is this? The process? Arepa. Arepas. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's what they were saying. Ah, that's a typical food from, from there, from Colombia. Arepa. Es una tortilla que le pones diferentes ingredientes y pues te lo doblas y ya está. It's Un, like quesadilla from here. Right? So it's just like, like uh, the one that we know, like quesadilla here, right? Un taco. It's likely similar, <laughs> right? Un taco. Mm -hmm. Kind of, kind of, kind of like that. Uh, la, la pupusa, la pupusa colombiana. Eh? La tila. <laughs> exactly. La arepa, la arepa es la tortilla que nosotros partimos. Cuando no, no, no quisimos hacer una pupusa, agarramos la tortilla, la abrimos y le metemos lo que El queso. Y oh. el huevo encima. Y cuando no hay, y cuando no sí, hay sí. Nada, por lo menos. ¿eh? Yo creo que Jennifer estaba en noticieros de allá de, de San Miguel, ¿verdad? Hay que no. no de San Miguel, hombre. No, no. No, no, no ya estaba no, Pachito. No, sí, hey, lo siento, no era, no era por otra cosa. <risa> Y que se se vio en, en la tortillita envuelta y, y disfrute. Ya, me. No, está Una bien. Jennifer. Sí, bien helada. Ok, ok. There you go. Thank you, Elmer and Jennifer, by the way. Uh, Marco, I guess All you're right. working with Jorge. All right. Yeah. Explain your process. Ok, I, I'm beginner. All right, do it. Uh, first, choose the ingredient. Second, prepare the mass with combined flour and baking powder. Third, knead the mass and add uh, knead the mass and make a square and add the tomato paste. Go ahead. El uh, beef. Okay. Um, later on the oven for 20 minutes. After put the ingredients, onions, mushroom, and cheese on the mass. Next, cook in the oven for 30 minutes. And finally, cut the slide and service. You give the word already there, the key. That's the key. Uh -huh. What is it, people? Pizza. 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 Ah, isn't it pupusas? Ah, okay. Pupusas. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, the slice. You, you, you said the corpse. You said the slice. Is. <laughs> yeah, is it the corpse in the slice? Right, <laughs> pupusas. <laughs> yeah, but... It's correct, pizza. <laughs> okay, pizza. All right. Okay, very good. Thank you, Jorge and uh, Marco. All right, Carlos, that's your turn, you and your classmates. Okay, I start. All right. First, when it's ready in proper point, it is a, it is cut from the trees, from mm -hmm. the trees. Um, second, it is taken to an area uh, where what is good is classified from what is bad. Mm -hmm. There, the best quality is packed and distributed to ranches. Uh -huh. Domingo. Uh, then, it is put, put up for sale to the public. Later, it's about build the the customer after 
I use it in the bags while in the kitchen. Okay, huh. okay. pretty okay. interesting. What is the final process, people? What's the process that they were talking about? <laughs> and everybody's like, what? Any idea? <laughs> I don't have idea. Don't have idea. Yeah. No. <laughs> really? Como no en bola, no hay. Eso fue. Micheladas. Micheladas. Una boca rara. <laughs> 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 Vanessa, Vanessa, what do, what do you think it is, Vanessa? Hello, teacher. Hi. What do you think it is? Uh, no, teacher. No, I don't know. Caña <laughs> <laughs> No, Vanessa, okay, okay, all right. Jennifer, you neither. No. Okay, I use that. that. That's kind of difficult to identify. Maritza? I don't know, teacher. <laughs> okay, all right. Let's go kind of slowly this time, all right? Uh, Carlos, let's read again carefully, slowly for everybody to understand, all right? And then Domingo, do it do it the same, all right? Do it again. So probably that in that second time, your class may identify what you're talking about. Okay. Um. When it's ready, in proper point, it is a cut from the trees. Second, it is taken to an area where what is good is classified from what is bad. There, the best quality is packed and distributed to branches. It is not talking, listen, it is not talking about food. Mm -hmm. Be clear on that. It is not talking about food. Okay. Domingo, continue. It is pop up. Pop up for sale to the public. A letter is, is about to be the cost, customer. Ah, okay. Uh, Let's remember that. Aster, Aster is used set in the bags while in the kitchen. Concentrado. Concentrado. <laughs> no, no es. De pollo. No, eh. Comida para gato. No, kitchen. Es, no sé si lo está pronunciando bien. Kitchen es la, la cocina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. La kitchen. Cocina. Ah, kitchen, kitchen. Ah, por eso yo lo he aquí. Perdón, lo siento. Y él dice en chicken o no pollo, ¿eh? Yo por ahí concentrado de pollo. Pero... I cook a kitchen in the chicken. It's like a... a I don't know. Okay. Okay. A bottle oil. I don't know. Oil. Eh, eh, la primera parte está prácticamente la... Exactly. Uh -huh. La clave. El first. Solo ah, lo bueno de los malos se empacaba ah. y se me el... Ajá, pero la coffee? primera que pronuncia. ¿Tenemos coffee? ¿The process de coffee? No. No. Similar. Similar. Ah, the, uh, maybe the, the beans. The beans. The frijol. Uh, no? Similar, pero en general. En general, en general. Consumé, consumé. All right, all right, all right. Say it one more time, Carlos. That that's the key. The, in the first two steps, read number one and number two. The last time. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Gwen is ready. In proper point. It is a cut from the trees. All right. When it's ready, Second. listen, listen. When it's ready, in the proper this? point, it's cut. Cut from the trees. From the trees. It is taken to an Alumita area. Alumita de maíz. 
Please. Where? Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Where? <risa> Where? Domingo solo veo que es... la cara. <risa> Perdón. Second, it is taken to an area where what is good is classified from what is bad. Ajá, all right. Once it is cut, it is taken to an area. Listen, it's taken to an area where it's classified. The good one and the bad one, right? Uh, yeah. Ajá. There. The best, the best quality is packed and distributed to branches. All right, and the one that is the best one, the best one, it is packed and distributed to branches. You know what is a branch, right? To, you know, okay. Like, very good. The, the fruit process, I don't know. Fruit? No. The fruit process? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the fruit process. The fruit process. The fruit, fruit process. process. Okay. All right, very good. That's in general, right? That's why Domingo and... <laughs> And Carlos were saying that it's that, that is very general. All right. Okay. Very good. It's not consomme, oh, right? Ah, so it's a milk card. It is not consomme. <laughs> okay. There you go. There you go. Okay. Good. Thank you, Carlos and Domingo. Now, Jonathan, let's read your process. Come on. Um, um, First, combine margarine flour for eggs and water and sugar. Uh, second, mix the water and flour. Third, add four eggs and sugar. Hasta no tenía que llegar. O completo lo Half, half of it. And your classmate will continue. A la mitad. Okay, Vanessa, go ahead. All right, Vanessa, let's continue. Okay. Later, cook 30 minutes in the oven. Uh -huh. After, remove from the oven and deplace the note. Um, mix, serve in the portions. Finally, we can eat. Okay, we can eat it. There you go, what they are talking about in the process, people. How, how may the cake? How to make cake? How my cake? Lasagna. No, no iba tanta azúcar, cree. A cake. Okay. Maybe. There's a cake. All right. All right. It's Come on. Why don't the, why don't the really? say, say, say the word? I mean, come on, Jonathan. Se supone ya no sentiste todas las pistas. De un solo lo digo, Jonathan. All right. How to make a cake. Very good. What kind of cake is that, Jonathan? Uh, chocolate cake? Tipo, something like that? Tipo, tipo brownie. Um, no, solo the... Oh, brownie. Solo <laughs> second Special part. brownie. Okay, good. Yeah, I mean, is that true that, that, that eating brownies is, is, is the best thing? I never tasted one. Never, ever. Really? No, never, never. For real, for, uh, for sure. Never. It's good. Never. It's good. Where uh, if I go if I go by 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 yeah. Sanzaba, where, where can I buy one? Similar, it's similar the chocolate, uh, the cake chocolate. Similar. Okay. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna taste one day. I'm, I'm gonna taste one of them when I go to San Salvador. All right. Okay. Pretty cool. There you go. So thank you, Jonathan and Vanessa. All right. Uh, Jennifer has already participated. There were two. Maritza. Yeah, Maritza is missing. All right, Maritza and Mauricio, if I'm not wrong. All right, let's do it. Okay. First, combine a uh, one kilo of flour with water. Second, add baking powder. Uh -huh. First, 
Combine salt and sugar. Salt and sugar. Later, add two cans Man. of tomato. Mauricio, continue. Uh, after 300 grams of cheese or mozzarella and pepper, nets, uh, place vegetables and pepperoni <laughs> to taste. Finally, back for the 15 minutes. Interesting. That's a big <laughs> chicken, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's a right. calzone. <laughs> ah, you're talking pizza. about pizza. pizza. Ah, okay, all right. La competencia. <laughs> La competencia. Is that, is, that, is, that, is that a pizza calzone, Maritza and Mauricio? <laughs> Oh, pizza, pizza normal. Only pizza. Normal pizza. All right. Normal pizza. Normal pizza. Normal pizza. Marco la regamos. Ellos le echaron mozzarella y nosotros queso normal. Ah, le pusimos. Le chisla. Ah, el pan barato le metimos. Son más tacaños <risa> ustedes. <risa> All right, very good. Queso duro rayado. Queso duro. Y de paso, si le agrega más sal, uff. Ok. All right, very good. All right, I think everybody has already participated in this activity. All right, very good people. It was good. Now, what are we going to do? We're just going to move up to one specific conversation that we got in uh, the manual, in uh, especially in page number nine. Page number nine. So if you got your manuals, let's go to page number nine. Uh, by the way, do everybody in here are already in the group? Todos, todos oh. los que estamos acá están en el grupo de WhatsApp. Me no. Yes. no. All right. Yo para no. los que digan no, entonces ahorita les voy a enviar el link para que se puedan unir al grupo de WhatsApp a través del chat acá en Zoom, ¿ok? Give me a second. Because it's very important people that we get there. Es importante que estemos ahí. Give me a second. I'm going to share the link. Es que me mandan memes. <risa> ok, cool Ahí está uh, Ahí está en el, en el chat de Zoom Pueden unirse al grupo de WhatsApp eh, Debo suponer que los que no están unidos En el grupo de WhatsApp no tienen el PDF Del módulo, ¿cierto? No Ok En este momento no Para los que no lo tengan O oh, no les aparezca ahí eh, Ahorita lo voy a reenviar de nuevo A... Um, para que lo podamos tener todos. Let's remember that it's really, really important. It's really important to have it. Es bastante importante poderlo tener. Así que permítanme un momento. Ya, ya lo vuelvo a reenviar. Teacher lo hubiera mandado mañana o tarde. Por si, por si caso hay alguno que no lo pueda meter desde ahorita en el grupo del pasado. Uh, mañana le va a tocar mandarlo otra vez el PDF. Ajá, simplemente lo que voy a hacer es, es reenviarlo igual, ajá, eh, sí, no hay problema, lo que pasa es que como hay algunos que se, se van uniendo al grupo, y eh, esos no lo tienen, no les aparece el, el, los mensajes previos a, a, a la unión del grupo, entonces por eso lo, lo, simplemente lo reenvié de ahí mismo de donde lo enviaron en la mañana, así que para mañana si se conectan algo otros igual voy a hacer lo mismo. Uh, let's remember that tomorrow is a day off, so we're gonna remove, uh, you know, like start classes again on Wednesday, right? Así que mañana es día de ir en Florida, así que <laughs> let's remember, right? we don't we don't have classes, right? Oh, day off. Yeah. ¿Quién tiene day off mañana? Everybody, right? Yeah. I. Everybody. Oh. Not everybody. Me, me no. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, not sorry, Mister. All right. What are we going to do? Okay, as I told you, let's go to that page. If you cannot have it already, I can share it in here, please. Let's go specifically to this conversation that we got in here. Look, what are we going to do as the last activity? 
We are going to just read this conversation. That's everything that we're going to be doing. And later on, we're going to uh, end up the class with this, okay? All right, it says, listen to your teacher, read the conversation that practice with the partner. What are we going to do? Con sus micrófonos ahí off, podemos ir repitiendo uh, la conversación. La voy a leer una vez, okay? I'm going to read it once. Uh, slowly, so you can listen the pronunciation of every word at the end of the conversation. Después, cuando ya termine de leer, si tiene más alguna pregunta con relación a alguna palabra, all right, just let me know, okay? And I will and I will do it. Then we're going to do a practice over here, right? As a final practice. This is a conversation between Anna and Mark and also uh, Diana. We need to start with uh, Anna. It says, Mark, Will you explain us what the manufacturing process is? Will you explain us what the manufacturing process is? It's a smart. Absolutely. Absolutely. This is how we make our top seller. This is how we make our top seller. First, says, we add a thick layer of chocolate. First, we add a thick layer of chocolate. Second, we add a thin layer of sliced almond. We add a thin layer of sliced almond. And it says, Anna, sounds great. And then, sounds great. And then, it says, Mark, finally, we add ginger. Finally, we add ginger. And it says, Diana, but what about people who are diabetics, right, or diabetic. But what about people who are diabetic? Can they eat it? Can they eat it? It's a smart. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. The amount of sugar is too high. The amount of sugar is too high. We consider those customers, we consider those customers and we have other products. And we have other products. We have a candy bar, we have a candy bar and a bubble gum and a bubble gum with zero sugar content, with zero sugar content. And it says, Anna, great, let's take a look. Let's take a look. There you go, people. Do we have any question related to the vocabulary in this conversation? Something that you do not understand? Uh, Thank you. Uh, the word uh, thick. 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 Thick, thick, thick means grueso, una capa gruesa. Ah, right. Thick layer. Layer is una capa, right? Mm -hmm. Thick layer, capa gruesa. Okay. Yeah, the color. Which one? Ginger. Jengibre. Jengibre. Yes. Almond. Almond. Almendra. Almond. 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 Yeah. And, and a slice, slice significa que va a partir de rodajas, right? Mm -hmm. What else? Amount. 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 No amount. Amount is la like cantidad. Cantidad. All right? Monto de azúcar. Yes. Okay. Any other one? Any other word? For example, what is the bubble gum? Yeah, como el chicle. Yeah, exactly, right? Como de mascar. Es un chicle. Como de mascar. Esos que son en, en, en como ruedita. 
esos que son como bolitas. Right? That's a bubble gum. Yeah, and a candy bar, you know what is a candy bar, right? Like uh, the sneakers, the sneakers one, right? That's a candy bar. All right, good. So this, so esto, what are we going to do? Before going up and finish the class, we are going to get a practice with some of you, all right? And for this, I want the help of Marcos and Alfredo. Can you please help me out with this? Uh, all right, me. Marco, I want you to be Anna and Alfredo, let's, let's be Mark, all right? All right. And, and let's, let's, let's read them as, as, you know, like in a row, right? Uh, who is Diana or Diana? All right, in this case, you take, take the role because the thing is that just uh, Anna and Diana just appear one little, little thing. So let's read it in a, in a sequence. No problem with that. All right, all right. Who begin? All right, Marco begins and Alfredo follow up the conversation. All right. Uh, Mark, will you explain us what the manufacturing process is? Absolutely. This is how we make our top seller. First, uh, we add the thick layer of chocolate. Second, we add a thin layer of slide amounts. Uh, sound great. And then? Finally, uh, with a ginger. But what about people who are diabetic? Can they eat it? Can they eat it? Can they eat it? Uh, I am not going to lie. Uh, the amount of sugar is too high. We consider it to consumer and we have other products. We have a candy bar, a bubble gum with zero sugar. But... Great. Let's take a look. All right. Perfect. Thank you, Marco. And thank you, Alfredo. Right? You did it excellent. All right. One more participation and we are end up in that. In the next class, at the beginning of the next class, we're going to continue with this conversation practice as a, as a feedback, okay? As just a review, all right? I just want the participation of Domingo and Carlos Walberto, all right? And uh, the next class, we're going to continue with the rest of the people who didn't uh, participate. All right, uh, Carlos, uh, you're going to take the Anna's uh, role and Domingo, Mark, and follow okay. up the sequence. Okay. Mark, will you explain us what the manufacturing process is? Absolutely. Uh, this is how we make our dog cell. First, we add a thick layer of chocolate. Second, we add a uh, day layer of silly armor. Sounds great. And then? Finally, we are ginger. All right, ginger. Ginger. But, but what about people who are diabetic? Can they eat it? I am not going to leave. Lie. The delight. Right. The amount of sugar is too high. High. We high. Yes. We consider two customer. And we had other products. We had a carry bar um bubble gum. Bubble gum. With Repeat. Bubble gum. Very good. We zero sugars content. Content. Right. Content, very right. Good. Content, right. Okay. Let's take a look. All right, perfect. Thank mm. you, Domingo, and thank you, Carlos. All right. Sure. What? Uh -huh, let's, let's take a look. A look. What let's is the take mean? A look. All right. Let's take a look. It's an expression that says like, ah, vamos a darle un vistazo entonces, o vamos a echarle un vistazo a eso. All right. Es como okay. cuando usted va a probar eh, ese producto. En este caso es como, ah. Vamos a, a echar un vistazo o vamos a probarlo entonces. All right. That's Thank what you. it says. All right. Good. También ahí depende de, de, del contexto en el que se esté utilizando. Por ejemplo, si vamos a ver instalaciones de una empresa o algo, let's take a look. Ah, vamos entonces a echar un vistazo a toda la empresa. All right. 
conocer sus instalaciones and everything, right? That's what it is. Yeah, or when okay. you buy a cell phone. Ah, let's take a look at the cell phone. Ah, vamos a ver qué trae de nuevo el celular que compramos, right? That's, let's take a look. Very good. All right, people. As I told you, uh, just to, these two pair are going to participate today. And on Wednesday, at the beginning of the class, as a feedback, we are going to continue with the people who did not participate in this uh, conversation. We are going to do it that day and we will do it as a feedback, okay? So we're going to stay at the stopping here with the class. I'm going to pass the attendance list and I'm going to stay with, uh, let me see who's going to be the first one in the list. Alfredo Alexander, you're going to be the first one with the 10 minutes feedback, okay? I'm going to stay okay. with you right after the class. All right? Okay, okay perfect. Just give me a second. I'm going to stop in here the presentation and I'm going to pass the attendance. Give me a second. All right, Alfredo Alexander. Present. Okay, good. Emil Carcañengues. Present teacher. All right, very good. Carlos Gualberto. Present, teacher. Okay. Uh, Domingo Alexander. Present. Perfect. Ever de Jesus. Present. Okay. Fatima didn't show up. Uh, Gilmar Cruz. Present, teacher. Okay. Jonathan Alexander. Present. Very good. Jorge Elvir. Present. Okay, Jose Matias. I'm here. Very good. Let me see. Carla Benazir. Carla. Good night, people. All right. Okay, Carla's not here. Good night. Uh, Marco David. Present. Okay, very good. Uh, Maritza Alcira. I'm here, teacher. Very good. Marlon Alberto is not here, right? Uh, Mauricio Alexander. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Romeo Alexis didn't show up. Rosa del Carmen. Hey, Rosa didn't show up again, right? Okay, well, she got problems. Vanessa Odette. Present teacher. Very good. William Eduardo. Present. Okay, very good. And Jasmine Melanie, who didn't show up today. And then we're going to have uh, Natalie Vanessa, didn't show up today. Uh, Stephanie Lisette, and neither William. All right, very good, people. So thank you for uh, connecting today to the first video conference, people. Uh, let's remember tomorrow is the day off. We will see each other uh, until uh, Wednesday, right? We're going to have, let's have tomorrow as a day off and let's take a look at Wednesday, okay? Bye-bye, people. Thank you for connecting. Bye. See you on Wednesday. Bye-bye. Have a good night. Bye -bye. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Hey, teacher, estoy alegre. Estoy alegre. <laughs> yeah, me too, you know, man. You know, you know. Definitely, me too. <laughs> okay, perfect. Yeah. See you. All right, see you, man. All right, bye-bye, everybody. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. All right, I'm gonna, let's wait. All right, Alfredo, uh, it's 10.05. We're going to have the 10 minutes, uh, you know, like as a feedback, just to reinforce the topic that we have been discussing today. So I don't know if you have any question related to the topic that we were discussing today. Uh, about the topic, no teacher. Um... I need practice the, the speak. Uh, right. I understand with, I understand uh, when you speak, uh -huh. but uh, I, um, me trabo. Uh -huh. uh, you get stuck when you try to speak. I uh -huh, want to uh -huh. speak. Uh, in my mind, I know that I speak, but not speak. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you, you know what happened to you? 
you have the vocabulary, you have the words, because you understand what I am saying, right? But when it's your turn to practice or to speak, I mean, the words that you know, the words that you have to use, uh, you know, like to, to, to talk to me, you got stuck and you, you don't know how to choose those words, right? And then uh -huh. you start thinking like, ah, I knew the words, but I, in that exact moment, the words didn't come out, come out to my mind. <laughs> that happens, that happens. And I mean, it, it is very, very usual to happen when we are learning, when we're starting learning, because that is, that is the key, right? The practice is basically the key to avoid that, to remove that and overcome that. Mm -hmm. One specific thing that, that, or one mistake that we do when we, when we start this process is that we start first in Spanish and then turn everything into English. But that's a big mistake, something uh, that we yes. should not do. Why? Because the brain, the brain is working double, double. Just imagine thinking first in Spanish and then uh -huh. translating everything into English. Okay. And that make you like, you know, like to, 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 to get stuck in there. Mm -hmm. That's what happened. But with practice, you know, like you, you can uh, overcome and you can uh, be successful just with practice. All right. And why don't okay. we dedicate these 10 minutes just to just, you know, like to practice, to practice. Right. All right. Okay. Uh, for example, for example, I, uh, now that you understood everything, all right, from, from, from the topic that today, now like, you know, like words to describe a process, why mm -hmm. don't you describe to me the process that you do since you wake up until you go to bed, all right? What you do first, what you go next, next, what do you do during the day, and what do you do until you go to bed, right? Let's do that. Let's practice that way. You can okay. start. Okay, uh, first I wake up uh, around the six or six, six, six uh, a.m. and I'm going to the bathroom. I, I take a, a shower, uh, take, brush my teeth and uh, Later, uh, later. Aha, later. I'm going to the. I walk to my work. Ah, you walk to your work? Okay. Uh -huh, I walk to my work and I start working in 7 a.m. At 7 a.m., okay. And um, I take my lunch at 12. Mm -hmm. uh, I rest uh, one hour mm -hmm. and at 1 p.m. Uh, I start again to work and I finish at 5 p.m. Ah, okay. Uh, after I, I try to uh, play with my, my little girl and and pass the the time the good time with my my family. Okay, very good. And 8 p.m. I connect uh, for the class. Ah, you connect to the class, all right. When you finish uh, the class, right after you finish the class, what do you do, what do you do next? What do you usually do next, right after you finish the class? Cuando termino las clases, ¿qué hago después? Ah, ajá. Right after you finish the class, what do you generally do? I'm going to the bed. Ah, you got I to talk bed. about uh, uh, I talk about things uh, uh, or, or what happened in my day with my with with my wife. Ah, with your wife. All right. Uh, okay. Let's talk a little bit, you know, like, like let, let's move a little bit from the context. Uh, how many children do you have? Uh, two, two. Two children? children. All right. Yes. How old are they? 
um, my first children, uh, mm -hmm. she have, uh, she, uh, she is, she is, she is, uh, very good. She is yes, she is uh, uh, 14 ah, years 14. old. Okay. Very and good. the second is uh, a five years. Ah. Okay, five years old. All right. Both of them are girls. Both of them are girls. Saludos. Ah, yeah. Both of them are girls. No boys. Sí, ah, yes, okay. yes. Very good. Very good. There you go. All right. Okay. Good. Uh, so it means that you live very close, very close from your work. You walk. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, uh, right. How many minutes do you walk to work? <laughs> Three minutes, four three? minutes. Really? Two, two yes. three minutes? It means I live in front of my, my, my work. <laughs> really? It yes. means it is, it is not like, like a, a, a block from distance. No, no. Is, that's, that's a dream job. Just yes. imagine, I mean, you, you don't spend money on bus fare, on gasoline and everything. Nothing, nothing. <laughs> you just cross the street and you got there. Yes. Wow. That's really nice. That's really, really, really nice. All right. This is a really, really, okay. re really nice job. Yeah, I mean, it's really, really good job. All right. And uh, in your free time on weekends, for example, uh, oh, when do you have day off? When is when is your day off? Uh, depend in in this moment. Uh, I work to the Monday uh, at Friday. At uh, Friday. From, one, from Monday to Friday. Yes. And um, when is Safra? Uh -huh. uh, I work uh, uh, rotative turns. Uh -huh. Turns rotative. Uh -huh. uh -huh. You got, uh, uh -huh. you got changeable work, space, um, shifts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, in, in, uh, when I work in normal. Uh, and uh -huh. uh, I play uh, basketball with my friends. And okay, pretty cool. I like play the guitar, uh, play with my my daughters, and okay. pasar buen tiempo con mi familia. Right, to spend good time yes. with your family. That's pretty cool. What you do, All right? In your work, it is. Uh, you know, it's by seasons, right? It's by seasons. Mm -hmm. uh, the mm -hmm. season is about to start because I guess I guess the safra right starts on on, on uh, November. November, right? November. This month, yes. This month, of um, November, and 15? finishes when? When is it finished? Um, April. Uh, April. Thirty uh, April. Ah, all right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Then mm -hmm. so it means you got five months. Yeah, five I mean, months. Yeah. This this coming five November. months. This coming five months is very, very like, like you know, like in movement for you. Yes, yes, yes. Uh -huh, um, okay, very good. There you go. And and what's the name of that that place that you work in? Uh, Ingenio La Cabaña. Ah, uh, okay, that's pretty cool. And here is it's kind of close one uh, uh, in here, but it's the one from San Miguel. The one that is pretty close uh, to me. Chaparrastique. Uh, yeah, I mean, el Chaparrastique. <laughs> yeah. I got it like uh, at what twenty minutes from my house. Uh, yeah, this man. is a real kind job of, for you. Kind of close, uh huh? <laughs> kind of close. I I don't really work in there, but I mean I have a lot of people, uh, a lot of friends who works in there, right? Yes. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, All right? And uh, what are like the just just to end up the conversation. What are like your plans when you finish these modules? All modules, all uh, modules. Uh, uh, well, uh, no, no sé cómo decir este, pero sería eh, no es no no estudié para para mejorar mi puesto laboral, sino personalmente. Aha, pa aha. Para aprender un nuevo idioma. Right. Okay, you, you might say, I didn't. I didn't. 
Okay, study. Study. All right, just to move up from move position. Up. Uh -huh. I did it for my personal development. Okay, uh, personal development. Yes, all right, yeah, you, okay. as yourself, right? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's really important nowadays uh, to know something else, not just get stuck uh, on our work, you know? Like, English is one of the best ways. Yes. Uh, one a really, really, really good tool nowadays to learn. Because if you go to another country who speaks not Spanish, but other language, you can communicate with people, uh -huh. right? Yes. And if you don't know English, it's like, you're like a kid. I mean, you, uh -huh. you don't understand anything to, to people, right? Yes. And in that way, I mean, English nowadays open a lot of words, a lot yes. of words, right? A lot of uh, doors, uh, another opportunities, right? right? That's yes. pretty cool. That's pretty cool. You got good projections there. Right. Thanks, Good. Sir. I guess I guess you have like uh, all set up with the platform, right? You got the platform, uh, 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 everything in there. Okay, very good. So that will be like then everything. So just as an advice, practice the most as you as, as you can in the in the class. Every time that you do not understand uh, something in the class, or if I am explaining something and you don't understand. Just let me know, okay? Teacher, I don't understand this thing. Uh, can you practice it? Or can you tell me again how it works, this is structure and everything? You know, like in that way, we are going to be practicing and you for sure will increase your level, right? Okay. Yeah, seguro que ya al finalizar básico, ya es, esas barreras que, que, ah, no, que no, no hay las palabras, poco a poco va a ir desapareciendo, se lo aseguro, por experiencia se lo digo. <laughs> All right. Hey, gracias, teacher. Ah, perfecto. Gracias. Entonces, Alfredo, nos vemos el miércoles entonces, ¿ok? All right. Bye-bye. Good night. Okay. Good night.